we didn't used to strategize. We didn't used to think when the patient came in newly diagnosed with metastatic pancreatic cancer that we had to sequence and that we had to think about toxicities and think about uh, what the outcomes would be with each of the regimens. So now we are. It's very important that we think about, well, listen, if I give fulfirinox up front, what can I use in the second line and the third line? And similarly, if I give a gemcitabine-based uh, treatment, uh, gemcitabine uh, nab pacotaxel, what then can I give in the second line? And it just makes more sense to use a sequence where you use a gemcitabine-based nab pacotaxel combination and then go on to onivide uh, the Naliuri regimen. Uh, and again, those are category one NCCN guidelines and it allows us to give at least two treatments. Beyond that, you can consider oxaliplatin-based treatments. His platin-based treatments are still uh, viable. Uh, so those sorts of regimens can be used as third-line therapy. Again, metastatic pancreatic cancer, the fact that we're treating more and more patients with second-line and third-line treatments is quite an accomplishment.